Hello everyone! Recently um, on my Facebook page there has been um, quite a lot of advertisements for this program or page or whatever it is called Ashy Binds Bikini Body Challenge. Now when first reading this I um, admittedly rolled my eyes uh, and ignored it but it keeps popping up and I just wanted to talk about how ridiculous the notion is that you should be putting pictures of yourself in your bikinis online for other people to judge your bodies as to how well you're doing with losing weight. First of all, I have to point out the blatant sexism um, in this as I've never seen a um, beach body challenge for men. Uh, they seem to be able to uh, go to the beach with their shirts off and look like whatever they like and not have one anyone bat an eyelid really. However, um, if you are in your bikini on the beach, um, apparently you will get uh, judged and looked at and if you have an ounce of fat on you, you haven't done your job as a woman looking good in a bikini. I just think it's very unhealthy to make it a challenge to become skinnier when a lot of the girls on this page, uh, I think the idea of the page is to post a before picture of you in your underwear or bikinis, which is very empowering, um, and an aftershot. And a lot of the aftershots actually look scarily skinny and unhealthy, yet these girls are encouraged by a barrage of comments saying, oh, you look great, babe, and keep going. And it's fostering a really dangerous eating disorder type mentality which is all too common in female society I guess I mean it doesn't really affect me and a lot of you say oh that's because you're naturally skinny anyway yeah I'm naturally skinny because uh, of my muscular dystrophy um, it breaks down my muscles and makes me look sinewy and weak so I can't really help the fact that my body is made like this however a lot of girls on here are really trying for that stick thin, really unhealthy look when their uh, bikini bodies were fine in the first place. And on the site as well, there's all these pictures of these really thin bikini models, and it's kind of that thin inspiration thing um, that uh, is on the anorexia fan sites where you aspire to be as skinny as this person or as skinny as this person. And I think what's even more disgusting is there are encouraging pictures on there of Ryan Gosling with the, the tagline, run for Ryan and stuff like that. You shouldn't be changing your body for A, a real guy, and B, let alone a celebrity, not fictional character, but come on, you're never going to meet Ryan Gosling, or nor impress him with your bikini body. It just makes me feel sick to think, that young ladies and young women are making themselves so skinny and yuck and all that for celebrities or to look great in a bikini and I'm all for self-confidence and all that jazz and that's not it that's it's the warped idea that because it's summer and because you should be in a bikini or in skimpy clothes that you should change your body to make other people happy or to seem hot. What's hilarious, and I don't know if they realise the kind of irony in this, is that on their Facebook page there are pictures of, uh, like, curvy women. I hate that word, curvy, but that's how they describe them, women with boobs and butts and then taglines under it like, I love being curvy and I love my curves and all that rubbish. Yet it's a website solely dedicated to losing weight and becoming as skinny as you can for your perfect bikini body. So I think it's a little bit funny and very, very stupid that they um, try and uh, balance it out with, uh, we love curvy women. It's like all women's magazines. The front cover is um, Lindsay Lohan drastically puts on weight, which is put on one kilo. And then a couple of pages in, it's celebrating your body for exactly what it is. Oh, just, I can't see how people can care about this. I can't, I know that I don't care about it, so, and other people do, which is fine. But I don't see how it can consume someone's life. I just find so many things more important than 
how tight my abs are or how firm my butt is or any of that. I just have different priorities. I guess because my body doesn't work in the first place, I don't really put that much importance on it. And you can like fitness without putting it all over a bloody Facebook and posting pictures of yourself in your bikini, asking for comments and seeking validation for how well you're doing in dropping all this weight, probably by very unhealthy methods. So, yeah, just wanted to have a little rant about the, um, the contradictions in uh, women's uh, inspiration pages and just how genuinely ridiculous and stupid and shallow and vain it really is. And why aren't women joining Holly's science challenge or Holly's better yourself and your character challenge? I should start that. I don't think many people would join though because it's not very attractive and you don't get to post pictures of yourself in your bikini. Thanks for listening everyone. I'll put the link down to the Ashy Binds Bikini Body Challenge um, so you can have a look or you can just perv on girls in bikinis, which I think most of you will just do. Thanks guys.